Hey, hey, Flowey. What? What do you miss the most out of anything? At the moment, being able to walk away from you. Flowey, what will it take to get through that thick head of yours that you are loved no matter what? Frisk cares about you, and we care about you, and when someone loves you, they forgive you for your mistakes, no matter how big they are. Oh, please, you don't really believe that, do you? Hey, Betty, you didn't really eat that much dinner. And I guess skipping it over to private sweet tooth. So, here. And don't lose hope. Just stay determined. Are we really gonna gloss over how much of a gosh dang bully Sands was about that situation? Am I the only one who doesn't think that was in any way okay with him? This fly may have screwed up, but he's not the only one in the wrong here. I don't reckon. Considering that smiley trash bag may remember some of our recent resets. I'd say there's a pretty good chance he might even remember some of my own resets, too. That's always been the real issue. Of course, Frisk never believed me. What the heck went down between you and Sans, Flowey? Would be easier to say what didn't. Wait a minute. Do you and Frisk share a room? I've always shared a room. What's your point? Random thought. Can you even grow leaves? Or roots? Or anything, really? I don't know about leaves, but that nose pod's way too small for me to grow my roots out. It would make picking through this bag way easier. Maybe make this more bearable, too. Does Sans really remember resets, though? Doesn't he just sort of figure it out based on stuff like facial expressions, clever observations, and maybe a touch of that weird deja vu everyone experiences? Is that what he told you? You know he's a huge liar, right? Hey, what not, pal? I'm sure we'll understand you more than what you might think about what happened with you and Sans. I seriously doubt that. Well, you used to do good things before you got bored with the outcome, right? Why not try doing that again? We all make mistakes, but nothing will get better unless you try. And hurting everyone around you won't make things easier. That was several of thousands of resets ago. Why can't I find a green one? Yo, Flowey, I have an idea. What if you pretend to feel something for them for some time? Who knows, perhaps they can let you out of that pot eventually, then you can do whatever you want to try in this world. It's much bigger than the underground, so there's a lot of things you'd like to try, right? So try to gain their trust, and you might be granted things. Use fake feeling. Knowing Frisk, I'd be in this dumb pond until I finally decide to reset this stupid timeline. I think I'll let the bottom. Hey, Flowey, seeing as you're still Toriel Sunil, how is your affiliation with puns? I've heard all of them before. Sort of takes the fun out of any joke, don't you think? Did I really eat the only blue one? And are they all red and yellow? Hey, Flowey. How are those gummy worms? A huge disgusting disappointment! Who the heck even likes the red and yellow ones? Sorry, sorry. Guess that's the look of the draw, eh? <laughs> anyway, take another bag if you want. I'll swap them for that one. Yes! But darn it, better not be any more of those gross flavors in there. I don't want to dig my head through that again. Don't they all taste the same? Say junk like that again, I'll dust everyone in this timeline. Then the next. Got it. There you go. Finally! Honestly, Flau, you should be more kind to first kid with everyone. Pay attention to them instead of shunning them. And when you do talk to them, try not to yell or say rude things to them. You might gain their trust that way. Just a suggestion. That sounds boring. So I've got a question for you, Flowey. Do you think even the worst person can change, that everyone can be a good person if they just try? No. I get that you've given up on yourself, Flowey, but clearly you know that Frisk will never give up on you. Trust that there's more to Frisk's faith in you than just the sentimental idiocy. When the two of you fought in the underground, miracles happened, souls were saved, monsters freed, and dreams literally became real. If the two of you work together, then there's nothing you can't accomplish. I... He did all the work. Frisk is just the idiot who got in his way. I know you call Frisk an idiot all the time, but do you honestly believe that's true? That Frisk acts the way they do because they don't understand? You're really not going to let me enjoy eating, are you? Flowey, he said before that we wish you were him. And even if you say you aren't, we understand. We want you to be happy. We want you to feel loved. No matter who you are. Don't you have something better to do? 
What if Fritz got you a bigger pot? Would that make you feel better? It might make my punishment more bearable. You say that we don't understand what happened with you and Sans, but I am certain you know much more than you think. After all, a notable amount of us askers have had a rather... killer time with him before. <laughs> Other universes don't count. Mm, they're not understood. So, Flowey, did Fritz ever do a, um, genocide route? They don't show any signs of remembering one. But do you have any memories of one? Well, I guess maybe it might be hard for you to remember. Considering he killed you at the end. <coughs> well, what did you just say? <laughs> 